Hello guys, welcome to Python Topic Tutorials. On this tutorial, I'm gonna talk about sort dictionary data by key and value. Uh, in this uh, session, I don't want to talk about uh, what is dictionary, how to create dic uh, dictionary and, uh, and et cetera. I only talk about how to sort dictionary data because uh, sorting a dictionary data is very important. Uh, if you are dealing with a large volume of data, sorting of data is very important because dictionary is one of uh, the data storage and we can store large volume of data in a key value pair. Uh, so uh, because it is very difficult to get expected output uh, very quickly and efficiently, uh, for, uh, in such cases, we have to reduce the searching complexity by sorting uh, the data according to uh, number series or alphabetic series. For example, let us assume uh, your phone, num uh, phone book in uh, your mobile phone and the contact uh, details of the people are stored with the name as uh, a key where no more should be repeated and uh, they are arranged in alphabetical orders. Yeah, the uh, contact details in your mobile phones are ordered uh, by default in alphabetic order. So that is uh, uh, very easy to quickly search the contact details uh, by using their name because the names are uh, a key and the details of the contacts uh, the values of that key. So we can simply search uh, the contacts from our phone and uh, we can uh, see the details uh, from that contact. That is the best example for uh, dictionary. That's why we need to sort our dictionary data. So we may have uh, hundreds of thousands of data in dictionary and we want to filter uh, data and uh, uh, very quickly and uh, efficiently. So we need to sort the data first. Okay, uh, there are two uh, techniques I'm going to show you in this session, but there are other techniques actually to sort the dictionary, but uh, I'm going to focus uh, the most important and efficient way of sorting dictionary data in this uh, tutorial. Okay, the first one is sort by key. How can we sort uh, by key? Uh, let us assume here we have a list of roots uh, prices per kg. Uh, uh, this is a demo. So let us assume, let's uh, assume we have uh, hundreds of thousands of uh, fruits information. Uh, so we want to filter uh, highly, uh, I mean, the top, the price is the least price and highest price uh, fruits from the dictionary data. So first of all, we have to just sort in ascending or descending order, either by value or by uh, key. So the first one is just, how can we obtain the keys from uh, uh, dictionary? First of all, it's, we can simply uh, obtain, we can sort uh, the keys from uh, dictionary, sorted method is a built-in method and it is highly efficient uh, method to sort uh, items in a list. Uh, Fruitus info, just we can obtain the list of uh, keys from the dictionary by using sorted uh, Fruitus info. Uh, this puts the list of dictionaries keys in ascending order or in alphabetic order. If the, so uh, we can also use keys by keys method. Uh, it is the same, it doesn't matter. Either you can use like this or without keys method. <coughs> so we are going to iterate. Once we sorted the dictionary keys, we can iterate over uh, each uh, key and obtain the values and assign uh, to uh, the key. Uh, and create new dictionary, actually. We create new di uh, dictionary by iterating the sorted keys over the sorted keys. Here, 
the method is using for loop. We can simply use for loop to iterate over the sorted because we can simply, uh, for example, uh, key in uh, sorted Brutus info. Then we can print, for example, Brutus info or, yeah, okay. Just call the key. Yeah, this is the values. We can we can obtain the values. This is uh, the values are not in a uh, not sorted, but the keys are sorted. Uh, in this case, we can uh, just iterate over each key, and we can create a new dictionary. Okay, let's create sorted. Process. Okay, we can create a new dictionary that is key. The keys are the key as well, but they are sorted. And we can just assign the values from the dictionary by uh, using the key. Uh, just we can use this one. Info key. And we can just uh, iterate over this one. We can call for every, uh, I mean, for every key. This is uh, actually this way is dictionary comprehension. And instead of writing look like this, creating a for loop, we can use comprehension mechanism. Comprehension mechanism is the most efficient way to uh, do uh, tasks look like this, uh, especially these workers, this uh, list, uh, that is uh, list compression, uh, uh, as we know, we can uh, create uh, for loopers and uh, new lists from uh, the already existing list. The same is true for dictionary. We can create a new dictionary from the already existing uh, dictionary. So uh, this is one way uh, and we can print sorted process. Yeah. Ananas, we can check that the old uh, dictionary uh, process info. Uh, the values of Ananas, uh, the price is 11.7 USD dollar. Uh, avocado is uh, we can call. So this is in ascending order, all in alphabetic order. So if uh, you wanna sort in reverse order, you can you can do this by calling. I mean, uh, inside the sorted method, you can pass reverse is true. You see, now previously uh, Ananas was the first order. We can uh, just check this in another cell. Now this is uh, in alphabetic order, but when you sort in reverse, by default in alphabetic order, the sorted function takes uh, the reverse is false. So we can put the reverse is, sorry, is true. I mean, uh, not false, true. Now, uh, previously it is in alphabetic order and now it's uh, printed out the reverse of the alphabetic order, which starts from the last uh, alphabet from Z to A look like that. So you can pass reverse is true, or if you leave this MBT, it's uh, by default sort in, uh, in alphabetic order, or you can put uh, reverse is false. That is in alphabetic order by default. All right, 
this is one way, way of uh, sorting uh, dictionary by key. What about uh, if you wanna sort the values? For example, if you wanna see the highest prices item, uh, you can sort uh, by value. You can sort the values of the dictionary and you can see the highest. In this case, we cannot uh, identify which one is highest price by sorting the key. So we can use another method. And another method is uh, just, we can uh, create sorted fruits by value, uh, create a dict, dict method. In this case, we can uh, use dict uh, function instead of uh, curly brass. Then we can just sorted function, we can call sorted function. Inside the sorted function, we can pass fruits info dot items method, we can use items method. Let, let's check uh, what is the use of items uh, sorted protest info items. This is going to sort each item, each item, not uh, by uh, actually, this is one of uh, the way uh, we can sort uh, item by item. So we can map uh, each item in a tuple. In so we can create a list because the result of sorted is a list. We can iterate over. For example, if you wanna iterate for item in sorted item. For example, if you want to uh, print each item, you can get a uh, tuple. Each item uh, converted, each di dictionary item converted into uh, a tuple, and we can iterate because uh, in this case, we can iterate uh, each item. We have two, uh, each item is a tuple, and we can refer by index. Okay. Uh, in this case, once we sorted this, we can use lambda function uh, to create and a lambda, a lambda function takes a key attribute or parameter and the key parameter uh, just, I mean, uh, the sorted uh, method takes uh, a key parameter. There is a parameter key. Uh, in this case, we can use key the key takes a lambda function. The lambda function, uh, for example, item, we can iterate over uh, this items, each item, uh, and we can take item index one. Item index one means from uh, each item, we can obtain uh, this index zero, this is index one, the values. Then we can uh, print this sorted process by value and we can get the result. You see, uh, by default, the values can be in uh, uh, ascending order. It starts from the lowest uh, price to the highest price. So the lowest price uh, fruit item uh, is orange, that is $8.9, and banana is 10.4, ananas is 11.7, and so on. The last, I mean, the highest price is, uh, that is uh, mango. So uh, if you wanna just filter the top three uh, uh, with highest price or the highest price, top three highest prices, uh, you can just, uh, you can pass a reverse attributes or parameter is true. You see, 
the highest price is sorted. Uh, so in this case, the values can be sorted in uh, uh, descending order. So it starts from the highest price to the lowest price. In this case, the keys cannot be sorted. Only the values can be sorted. So this is the best technique to sort uh, dictionary data by value. And the first one is sorting dictionary data by key. So the two techniques are very, very efficient uh, and the best and the very important uh, techniques to sort dictionary data and to search uh, the dictionary data quickly and efficiently in Python. So this is today's lesson. If you like uh, this tutorial, please don't forget to uh, share and like, and also uh, you can send thanks gifts to support us. Thanks for watching today.